Hey guys, it's Khan from Gamers is Proud, and we're back with our part two for Kingdom Hearts Free Chain of Memories walkthrough for GBA or PC. Anyway, let's continue. We're in this sleeping room. Yeah, um, it's kind of easy, this bit anyway, all you gotta do is fight and the only thing you really gotta to aspire to do is level up, that makes it easier to fight the guard armor. Where are you little? Um, if you press backspace or select, it shows you where you gotta go. See this one here is open, and then after that, Go up through there, into that one, then up, and enter. Um, I'll use this one because I've got doubles. <clears throat> I'm just skipping this. All it is is Leon wanting to practice and teach you. It tells you to stock cards and everything and tells you about card breaks. Um, yeah, he's telling you that zero can defeat any card, but it can also be defeated by any card. So, that's when he tells you to stop, which you do by simultaneously pressing the A and S button for computer, or L and R button for the Game Boy, or whatever. And that's how you do your slates and stock cards. And now he gives you Simba and the gave guidance which lets you go into the next area Moogle points. Now I'm just going to go back to my previous room to try and get some more Moogle points because I use them a lot. It's how you can get cards, like very good cards, like Cloud when you get him. You can get heaps of clouds by getting Moogle points if you're lucky. So I always figure it's a good thing to do to go back and just try and stock up more on your points. And if you ever want to check how much Moogle points you have at any time, just press enter. See, I have 210. Anyway, time to continue. Meeting ground. This card is good because it means at the start of every fight, you, um, your friends appear at the start of the fight. So it's kind of handy. Huh, I guess I was wrong. What a sworn I was right. I'll have a. Oh no, that's not what it does. Meeting ground increases the card value of your friends. Sorry, that was my bad. Okay, it doesn't even make your friend stronger. I'll go have a look at what it does in a second, second after this fight. Because now I'm really not sure and I feel kind of stupid. That card. Ah, oh, I was right the first time. Cut friend cards appear at the start of the battle. Uh, 
I should never have doubted myself. In my opinion, I reckon Goofy's better than Donald as a friend card. Sure, Donald can heal you, but he can also heal the enemy if he uses fire or something on a fire enemy and etc. Whereas Goofy, he just does a straightforward attack. And, um, sorry about that, I had to hiccup. And if you have two Goofies, he stuns them, and three, he goes for a Goofy Tornado, or Whirlwind Tornado, or something. And that's very powerful because he can hit the enemy multiple times. I'll show you how he stuns. If he hits them, they get stunned, they get little dazes over their heads, and they can't move for a little while. Just kind of how you get the initiative at the start of the battle. Oh, Blizzard, that's good. Three. That's just giving you the next key and all that. Get that nickel for you. Oh, I prefer these ones. Um. Bad thing about Goofy is he charges whatever way you're facing. So that would be a good thing to, I don't know, change in the future, I guess. I'm just going to go for a Donald, see if he'll heal me. No, oh, wow, I was facing him. Another good thing about the sliding dash slate, it's probably one of the weakest out of them all, but you can control which angle you walk to, or slide to, and that's handy so you can, yeah, go from one side to the other and aim to hit most of them. Seems like this one's gonna be a bigger fight. All right, Goofy. This is that's how good Goofy is. Just fully knocks him. Bam! When they're all lined up like that, they don't stand a chance. And that recovered those two bastards. Pardon my language. Um, and Teaming Darkness. Alright, that's all of them cleared. Time to just run around and get some points. Okay, some new cards. Alright, um. Well guys, I guess this is it for our part 2, tune in next time for part 3 where we fight the guard armor and axle.